Hey everyone, Chris here from Gamertech Toronto. In today's video, I'll show you step-by-step -step how to enable TPM on your Asus motherboard. This is one of the key requirements for installing or upgrading to Windows 11, and it could also improve your PC security overall, so let's get started. TPM stands for Trusted Platform Module. It's basically like a security chip built into your motherboard or CPU that stores encrypted keys. Most modern Asus motherboards already have it built in, so you just have to enable it in BIOS. First thing we're gonna do is restart our computer. Once it's booting back up, spam that delete key or F2 until you enter the BIOS. Then we're gonna go ahead in BIOS and switch to the advanced mode. If you're in easy mode, just press F7 to switch to the advanced mode. Next, we're gonna have to locate the TPM setting. If you're already in the advanced tab, go ahead and select trusted computing. If you're using an AMD CPU, enable AMD FTPM. If you're using Intel, enable PTT, which stands for Platform Trust Technology. Once you've switched it over, go ahead and press F10 to save your changes and then your system will just automatically reboot. Turn your computer back on, let's go into Windows and now we can check to see if Windows also recognizes that we have the setting enabled. Once you're back up in Windows, go ahead, press the Windows key plus the R key on a keyboard. Type in tpm.msc and hit the enter button. You should see a message that says TPM is ready for use. A quick little troubleshooting step is if you don't see this feature enabled in your BIOS or you can't turn it on, do a BIOS update. We have tons of videos on pretty much every motherboard out there on how to update your BIOS. And that's it. TPM is now enabled on your Asus board. If you found this video helpful, subscribe for more tutorials and PC build guides just like this. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next video.